So he burned his hand on her hot steak platter. Yes. Uh, all right. Well, I assume we just present this. Yeah. Got him. Yes. What's this, Council? Yet another print? I've already looked at this one. <sighs> yes, Your Excellency. I believe photographic prints are an amazing invention, and they're much better than shitty drawings. If you're an artist, <laughs> get fucked. <laughs> when we humans look at the scene, it, Ryan. we miss things. But in a photograph, things we may have overlooked at, at the time are recorded forevermore. Do hurry up, Rookie. What are you trying to say? To inconvenience this poor lady any further really would be quite inexcusable. Actually, we may need to stay... We may need you to stay with us a little longer, if you don't mind, Miss Brett. I really hope one of her next line... I just imagine it'd be very funny if her next spoken line was just dot 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 fuck <laughs> you see Shit. it's very clearly <laughs> visible in this other photograph how did the victim come to have that unusually shaped burn on his wrist the reason is recorded here forevermore quote the raven what that was, that oh. was never more <laughs> yeah. fuck you're right <laughs> Everybody cancel Zach. He doesn't know his Edgar Allan Poe. <laughs> you can't fool me with your little bluffs, boy. Boy. Got him. If that's your game, then let's see how it plays out. Show the court exactly what you mean. What oh, is it on. in this photograph that explains the reason for the victim's burn? Don't waste my fucking time, kids. Yes! The, the beef steak? No, but I'm about to have a beef with you. Actually, Ooh. the point is the metal plate the steak was served on. The plate? Ah. Ah! Your Excellency, are you all right? As you can see, there's an emblem on the plate. I would guess it's some sort of trademark of Le Carnival. Ah! Don't you mean the trademark of Applebee's? <laughs> no, actually, I guess we're at Longhorn Steakhouse now. <laughs> oh, God, I just switch gears? <laughs> All right, everybody. Uh, today's sponsor, we're switching from Applebee's. We're going to Longhorn. All right, everyone, forget every Applebee's joke I made about the Carnival. Zach, go re-edit the old videos. Okay, okay. It's Longhorn Steakhouse. <laughs> we're, yeah. Apple we're standing for Longhorn now. Uh -huh. Standing for Longhorn. What makes Longhorn Steak so legendary? Some say it's our flavor-packed signature seasonings. Some just say, mmm. Uh, no joke, though. Longhorn Steakhouse some, has some white cheddar stuffed mushrooms Ooh. that are oh, wow. the bomb. That does sound really good. Uh, the emblem on the steak plate and the victim's burn are exactly the same shape. Gakuten Saiban cheers five bits and says, It is happy hour at Longhorn Steakhouse. <laughs> ah, shit. Yeah! Ryanosuke, you genius! You're spot on! Which means the victim must have suffered this burn while he was present at the restaurant. <laughs> Dark Angel Law cheers 100 bits and says, Come on, that's a burn totally shaped like an em. The That's totally a burn and emblem shaped like an apple. <laughs> but, but even if that's the case, we can't know if it happened on the day in question or not. Oh, shut up. It yeah, could have been the day before. Or the day before that. Or the day before that. Or the day before that. Stop. <laughs> Two hours later. Or the day before that. It most likely happened at some other unrelated time. Well, um... Hmm. Objection! Oh my god, I just lost what he sounds like in my head. Sadly, prosecutor... Oh god, I'm going... <laughs> Sadly, 
sadly, prosecutor, uh, Jesus, I can't do it's it. It's hard. What it's happened? hard. Oh, Clear no. your mind. My Clear brain your mind. broke. My brain broke. <laughs> Jesus. I'm a bad voice actor. Zero out of ten. Uh oh shit. Uh, Why you remember his name? Uh, Lizard Taco God, which again is a great reference to uh, our community stream this week. Uh, again, if you'd like to be involved in our community streams and play games with us, uh, join our Discord and uh, subscribe to us on Patreon, where you can play with us uh, once a month. But Lizard Taco God donated thirty dollars and sixty nine cents, saying, "You know why this number, baby?" And yes, folks, that does in fact get us to four hundred and twenty dollars and sixty nine cents. Lizard Taco mm, God is nice. so good. That was so. That, that was is such a, good, a funny. That bit. is a good name. All right, all right. How's your cousin? We're, we're 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 back in it. Sadly. Sadly, Professor Ouchie, the chances of that are extremely slim. Yeah, it was all right. You got it. Thanks. Uh, Dark Angel Launcher is under a bit saying, Wes, my brain broke. Audience, well, we've known that for a while now. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's true. Why? The outline of the burn is clearly discernible. There it is, it's back. Such a serious injury would have caused quite a commotion in the restaurant. He would have been all like, Oh, fuck! That burns! Shit! Holy fuck! Why is that so hot? Jesus! Shit! Christ! Fuck! Hell! <laughs> Wouldn't you agree, Inspector Hosanaga? Bugger! <laughs> Bugger all! I can't imagine having missed such a terrible disaster, certainly. But... But... I would say, looking at the picture of the wound, that it wasn't suffered very long ago. And, although it's not a particularly large burn, it's extremely well defined, as the defense just pointed out. This was no mild burn, that's for sure. Can you be more spe specific, in Inspector? Uh, that burn hurty? <laughs> <laughs> Burn, go well, burn. let's see. If the plate was at around 90 degrees centigrade, a burn like that would have taken around three seconds. How do you know that? Are you a police inspector or a doctor? It's inconceivable that a victim wouldn't have let out a scream of pain then. I've been investigating at the restaurant for several weeks already, but I've not heard anyone scream at all. Is the head waiter of, Le, of Le Carnival, or shall I say, Longhorn Steakhouse, I can testify to that without hesitation. But you... You're a detective, not a waiter! So it must have been post-mortem, then. There you have it. Something isn't right here. As the detective said, anyone who burnt themselves on a piping hot plate for three whole seconds would scream in pain. There's no question of that. Unless Dr. Wilson was a fucking badass. <laughs> he just looked Giselle right in the eye and just went like... <laughs> And yet, Inspector Hosanaga never heard the professor scream. Not on that day, or any before it. That's right. And the strange thing is, on the day he was shot, I didn't hear him cry out either. What are you suggesting? It was post-mortem. Well, if the professor had carelessly laid his wrist on the plate for anything like three seconds that day, that would be beyond careless, I think, Counsel. Yes, Judge. Then the rest of us in the restaurant, myself, the sergeant, and the old antique stealer, all of us, without question, would have heard him scream. Uh... <laughs> Wouldn't you agree, Pr Prosecutor Ouchie? Wouldn't that leave a big ouchie? <laughs> uh, well, y yes, uh, I suppose. Being so, the ouchie expert. So, the question is, why didn't a single person hear Dr. Wilson scream? I... I almost don't believe it. Rinosuke, do you think... 
Can it really You're a better like lawyer that? than me. Can it really be true? I never dreamt we'd arrive to a conclusion like this. But I'm starting to think that maybe... Oh, no. We've been led into a terrible trap. It's a it's trap. A trap. <laughs> uh, actually, I, I think I know what the whole solution is. Okay, okay. There's only one explanation I can think of to think of to make sense of this apparent impossibility. On the day in question, when he suffered the burn to his wrist, Dr. Wilson was Sorry asleep. asleep. <laughs> <laughs> was already deceased. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, he's already dead. No man could remain silent while his wrist was burning on a piping hot plate for three whole seconds. That's clearly impossible. Apart from one particular situation. Council, what are you suggesting? Yes. It's only possible if the man was already dead. It already? Dead? Oh shit, she didn't like that. Knowing what we know by now, truth. it's the only possible explanation. When the beef steak was brought to Dr. Wilson's table that day, the professor was already dead. Omaya wa no shinderu. That's madness! No, this is Sparta! Got it. This is Nippon! <laughs> Damn it. Order! Order, please! Uh, Council, explain this absurd notion at once. The victim was killed by a gunshot. That's right. That's absolutely right, Your Excellency. This this is just another ridiculous ploy by that lucky student. But clearly, he has no grasp on the fact. No, Prosecutor Ouchie. It's you who has no grasp of the facts. Good fox. I beg your pardon? As soon as it became apparent that the victim had suffered that burn while at the restaurant, this whole case was turned upside down. Or have you not grasped that yet? <laughs> Your Excellency, the court must hear from this witness again. If it's true, as we, as we now believe that the victim was already dead before the gunshot was heard, it's highly likely that Miss Brett knows something about it. Mm. Incredible. I certainly didn't anticipate this twist of events. I'm sorry to say, Miss Brett, that you will have to forget your luncheon engagement. Yes. Your Excellency. Show us your breakdown sprite. Do it. <laughs> the justice system in our country may be in its infancy. But rest assured, all reasonable doubt must be dispelled before I am prepared to pass judgment. Because I am an actually good judge. Thank you, Your Excellency. I'm so looking forward to when my children and my children's children grow up to be great judges. <laughs> Hopefully they'll move to Japanifornia <laughs> and become just honorable judges who aren't easily bribed by lunchboxes. <laughs> I know that's really specific, but... And by titties. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, damn it. Uh, let me see your eyes. Show me your face. Come on, let me see your face. <laughs> I don't know if you have pretty eyes. That's I'm that's what pretty, I, I'm a sucker that's, for pretty eyes. <laughs> show me your show me your face is what the respectful bro says. <laughs> show me your eyes. What was that smile? Yes, of course. I mean, I'd be delighted. To oh know. shit! She's speaking uh -oh. Japanese now. Here it comes. Here it Yo! Comes. Especially if it helps relations between my country and yours. <gasps> uh, miss, Miss Brett, you, 
speak Japanese? Nihonga Hanasemaska? Oh, I like that some words yeah, yeah, yeah. are not are yeah. not in Japanese. That's good. Well, of course I do. I am studying in your country after all. But then why have you been speaking through an interpreter until now? My mother tongue, the Queen's English, <laughs> is the most refined and elegant language in the world. Okay. As a gentlewoman, I try to avoid speaking in your vulgar tones as much wow. as possible. Wow! Racist alert! All Jeez. potential shipping is gone. Pizza. Racist. Uh, Why would you geez. say that in the Japanese Supreme Court? Apparently, you're also an idiot, Miss Brett. <sighs> Ouch, are you still simping? But it seems the men in this land possess more none of the chivalrous virtues of English gentlemen. Yeah. So I can like see Jack that I shall Ripper. have to lower. <laughs> yeah. So I can see that I shall have to lower myself to communicating with you all on your own level. Oh, uh, well, you are the epitome of a true <laughs> English gentlewoman. It's a racist. We are truly honored by this. This lavish consideration you so graciously afford us. Judge is uh, pissed. I uh, see. Fucking English. In that case, Miss Britt, I will now ask you to testify in your own words. This is why I hate the fucking English. <laughs> uh, the events leading up to the death of the victim, Dr. Wilson. Still haven't seen the eyes, though. I know. It's a bit, that's a very good tease. Yeah. To be like, you're always so close to seeing mm -hmm. what her eyes look like. Dark Angel Lodge here at 100 bits saying, I wish for good relations between our nations. Also, your language sucks. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're finally going to hear her own words on the matter. Things are getting interesting, Ryanesuke. <sighs> Unfortunately, I have no idea when the poor man burnt his wrist like that. When the waiter brought my steak, the professor and I raised our glasses in a toast. As far as I've heard, the post-mortem report showed no other possible cause of death besides the gunshot. If there's some other way a man's life can be taken without leaving a trace, please do show me. Um... Actually, that's a good point. Can we... Can you actually show me the picture of his dead body? Sure. But of course, this country's inferior investigative techniques probably wouldn't pick up on it anyway. Stop. Why would you say that? You suddenly went from one of the best, like, smart villains in the series to now you're just as bad as the rest of them. That most captivating and beautiful testimony will go down in the Supreme Court's history. Thank you. Easy does it. Can you check the photo? Yeah. Sorry. Uh, uh, I'm yeah. guessing he was poisoned. The first one? Yeah. Uh, speaks for Yeah, not enough blood for it. Not enough blood. That's a that, that's also, my, that, that, also the, the glass is empty in this one after he's dead. And it wasn't in the yeah. other one. That's, that, that, that's a post. That's a post-mortem gunshot. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, and yes. and a, a, a living body would have bled much more than that. Also, she was certain to take one of the glasses, which she was certain to take one of the glasses because that would have been the one that yeah that's would leave evi would leave evidence. That was why I expected that she took the glass. Um, yeah, I mean, uh -huh, it, it, uh -huh, it, it yeah, uh -huh. it sort of became obvious when we learned that. Mm -hmm. uh, I hope that this is the last time I will have to sully my lips with the coarse tones of your unbecoming tongue. Fuck this person. Oh, forgive me. I do hope I haven't insulted anyone. Not at all, not at all. It is a delight merely to hear you speak, dear lady. And it seems very clear from your testimony that this fresh talk of the victim's burn is utterly irrelevant. I will be speaking to your country's Minister of Justice about what has happened here today. The Minister of Justice? 
May that irritating little bully of a student be given the harshest punishment possible. Amen. Whoa! Oh! Uh, um, thanks. W was that a prayer, then? I'm about to end this chick's whole career. <laughs> <laughs> well, you'll have to forgive the irritation, Miss Brett, and put up with a cross-examination for now. I expect you've noticed that this little bully of a student, as you put it, <laughs> doesn't miss. He's extremely confident. He doesn't miss. Look at that miss. composure. Look at him. He's the picture of Japanese elegance. <laughs> um, I'm sure I don't need to remind you, Council, that this will be your final cross-examination in this trial. If you fail to demonstrate any problems with this witness's testimony... Uh, we'll get it. I will be ruling on the case immediately. Is that clear? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes! Yes! Yes, Your Excellency. Nice. Oh, that was so good. Hi. He's, a, he's getting in his zone now, baby. This, this is the birth. This is the birth of the lawyer. <laughs> Don't let me into my zone. Don't let me into my zone. Don't let me into my zone. I'm definitely in my zone. <laughs> I was gonna say, is that how all lawyers are birthed with a slap in the face? <laughs> you pass the bar exam and they slap you in the face. Pass the bar and, and then uh, you get stuck in Columbus traffic for an hour and a half. <laughs> <laughs> I guess when you finish then you the may proceed with the cross examination. I really hope he's like, ouch, that really hurt. <laughs> Shit, Catboy Mothman says, What am I? An idiot sandwich. Which, yes, that is exactly what he just did to himself. Fuck. He just made himself an, an idiot, idiot sandwich. sandwich. Oh, fuck, King Kieran said, More like an idiot bap. Ah, That's a great ah, joke. King Kieran, you, you brought it home. Damn it. Thank you. Thank you. Shit. That's so good. That's really good. <laughs> Idiot bap. <laughs> uh, okay. I think we can skip this one. I, really, it's, it's... No other possible causes of death. What does? Can we recheck the postmortem reports? Oh, sure. Just to, I'm actually just curious, I mean, because it's true, the postmortem report did say. Shortly after two, single bullet fired close range, fatal hemorrhage from pectoral ballistic trauma, no exit wound, did not pass through the body. Okay, so we've got. Hey, you know what really help about this autopsy report? Hmm. If someone were to. Update it? Update oh, it. shit. Oh! Oh! I think that's I think that's what the the thing she's gonna come back and give is gonna be. Shit, yeah, I think you're right. Without leaving a trace. If someone is shot or strangled or stabbed or thrown from a height. However a person's life is taken however a person's life is taken, there are always telltale traces on the body. Yeah, and bullets to the Quite chest right. tend to leave a lot of blood, which I didn't see on him. Mm-hmm. Quite right, dear lady, and as our police force has thoroughly examined the body of the deceased, there can be no doubt. Isn't that right, Inspector Hosadaga? As I've said, I always aim for a flawless investigation. Mm. I don't ever achieve it, but that's what I <laughs> aim for. No, about, no, no statement to whether I achieve that goal. That's just what I try to do. Shoot! If you shoot for the moon, you'll always land amongst the stars. Inspector <laughs> Hosanaga. Uh, hmm, there would be physical, there would be physical traces with all those causes of death. That's true, but maybe there's some other way of killing someone that doesn't leave a mark. If heaven forbid you doubt me, young man. You're going to have to tell everyone how exactly you think the professor did lose his life. Okay. Otherwise, I'm afraid your argument falls rather flat, doesn't it? Flat? Like that sparkling water you were drinking? 
Oh no, perish the thought! Calling such a sweet young lady's innocence into question? On my honor, I, Takitsuchi Auchi, will cut down any who dare cast such aspersions! Shut the fuck up. Hmm. A way of killing someone that leaves no trace. We need some evidence to back us up here. Yes. Evidence. Be really what great if they would fucking show up with that evidence right about now. Um, I don't press this too, I yes. guess, because they're gonna say that they don't do a like autopsy. Inferior? What do you mean by that? In the lands of the Great British Empire, the police store everything found at a crime scene for later examination. But in this country, you investigate once, and that's the end of it. Isn't that so? Quite right. Longhorn Steakhouse is open for business as usual today, just days after the incident. Very good. Exactly. Which means that even if the investigation takes a different direction, vital evidence may be lost. Uh, ah! can we, can we, can we do something about this, that? This, this is a new gameplay mechanic, yeah, mechanic I think we're about to get. Also, Chrono Wizard says... Even uh, I've just realized something. In the original games, we have the Silver Samurai, but in this game, Ouchie is the Simpin' Samurai. Hey! <laughs> it doesn't even occur to your na naive detectives to try to preserve the crime scene. I'm trying to be as tactful about this as I can, you understand? I think you are. Yeah, really. <laughs> Oh, a killer blow! The lady is as formidable as she is beautiful. Amazing. He's actually admitting our police may be flawed. Perhaps Prosecutor Ouchie is finally starting to see sense. I very much doubt that. <laughs> Still, there's something about what Miss Brett just said. There was a moment before when something didn't seem quite right. What do you think, Ryunosuke? I... I think it's going terribly. No matter how much I press her, I'm not turning up any new information. Yes, as I suspected. She's a tough witness. We need to find a way to break her testimony, or the cross-examination will be over. But... but that would mean... I have to find a way. There must be some clue somewhere that will help us find a chink in her armor. I also went for the British spelling of armor. Kazuma! Amour. What, Rinosuke? There is one thing I noticed. Something that's been bothering me. Have you been- have you noticed that he's coughing up blood? <laughs> What's up with that? Bothering you? You mean, about Miss Brett? Actually, no. Do you not see the floating bubble next to the inspector's head with the dots in it? Or am it's I, about or am that. I, or, or am I, or the drugs kicking in again? <laughs> it's about that duck on her head. What are you talking about? <laughs> She's not wearing a hat. About the why person standing. Seeing, why do you keep seeing headgear that doesn't exist? <laughs> about the person standing next to her, Inspector Hosanaga. The detective. Yes, he seemed to react a little strangely to Miss Brett's last, last statement. I was wondering if it might be significant, if it might present an opening, maybe. All right, I have an idea. Try pressing her on that last statement one more time. If you think so, but... But this time, instead of targeting the woman herself, Let's see what we can get out of the detective. All right, then. I wonder what Cosima's thinking. I'll find out soon enough, I suppose. Once I press Miss Brett on her last statement again. Okay, I think this is a really weird way to do this, but sure. Yeah, maybe you have to double press the yeah. statement. Yeah, uh, we have to go through the entire thing again. I wonder That's if it simplifies after the first time you do it. Yeah. Uh, okay, so press this. Yes! Lost, Empire, wait till dude starts coughing. 
Simpin' Samurai. Wait. Okay, here we are. Wait. Uh, but what, what do I do? Uh, just keep going. Yes! Yes! There it is again. The detective's reaction is just the same as before. Why? Up until now, the detective has been in the stand with Miss Brett as her interpreter. But things are very different now. For this testimony, the detective is just listening to what the Englishwoman has to say. This could be a golden opportunity. What do you mean? When people are actually testifying, they're usually very careful not to let anything slip. However, when they're listening to someone else speak, you'll find they often let their guard down. You're right. Look at him. He's lost in his own thoughts. It's time to pursue the man in his train of thought. Sonny, pursue? I'll explain how to do it now, Rinosuke. It's all to do with the witness marker. What? Marker. Oh. At the moment, we're focused on Miss Brett, who's the person actually making the current statement. Oh. But by moving the marker left and right with A, D, you can turn your attention to other people in the stand. While you're looking at the other witnesses, you'll be able to pursue them with space. If you can catch the person at just the right time, you might uncover some new information to pursue. If you ever notice a strange atmosphere amongst the people in the stand, take a good look around. All right then. So first I should move the marker across with A, D, and focus on the detective. Then pursue him with space and see what's on his mind. Here we go. Ike? Exactly. Which means that even if the investigation takes a different direction, vital evidence may be lost. Uh, Dark Angel Law cheers 100 bits and says, Fun fact, this isn't the first game in the franchise where multiple witnesses at once is a game mechanic. It was also done in Professor Layton vs. Phoenix Wright. Yeah, yeah. Uh, pursue. Oh! You, excuse me! That was a new one. <laughs> with the, with the, <laughs> Stop dying, dude! I'm so sorry. I, I didn't mean to shock you. He really was lost in his thoughts. Deeply. It looked like you were thinking something just now, Inspector. Perhaps having heard what the lady next to you had to s perhaps having heard what the lady next to you had to say. If there's something you'd like to say, please share it with the court. Attention! What is the meaning of this? It's the delightful Englishwoman who's testifying at the moment. If you can't find fault with her testimony, then the cross-examination should be over. Immediately. Oh, is... is that how it works? Absolutely not. Hmm? The detective is in the stand, which makes him a valid witness. It feels like so not how it's supposed to work. Yes, not to mention the fact that he's intimately involved in the case. Inspector Hosanaga. Yes? Do you have something to add in relation to the statement just made by Miss Brett? Well, technically you could poison someone. Just wanted to put <laughs> that out there. I mean, I do it all the time. <laughs> yes, if you don't mind, I would like to speak. <laughs> no. She's pissed. She didn't like that. The lady is right. Our country's police practices are not as modern as those used in Great Britain. Which is why I, Satoru Hosonaga, always strive to make every investigation I'm involved in flawless. What do you really mean by that? I'll tell you what I mean. I won't have evidence lacking on my watch. I'm not afraid to take everything I can from the scene of the crime. It's preserving evidence, you see. 
I don't care if they call me a crime scene thief. I'm not ashamed of what I've done. Sorry, what? <laughs> Did guy steal some crime scenes? Is he Phoenix's ancestor too? A crime oh, scene thief? Dad? <laughs> well, it looks like the lady's remarks touched a nerve. Take this, for example. <gasps> oh. <laughs> is that? This is the bottle of carbonated water that I took to the victim's table on the day in question. And yes, it's lost all of its fizz, having been opened three days ago now. Fuck. Man, it was carbonated water. I don't care what anyone <laughs> says. Yes, there's some left in the bottle. I can see it. One day our police force will be among the best in the world. The time is coming. I guarantee it. <laughs> oh, but I won't be able to survive to see it. I know, <laughs> I'm not going right. to see it. I can't say I condone the witness's actions, but I do understand the sentiment. The court will accept the glass bottle of water as evidence. Covering your water. Hey, yep. we got some more evidence, team. Evidence? Hmm. Miss Brett. Can you confirm this is indeed the bottle from which you drank on the day of the victim's death? Yes. It was that bottle. <laughs> Dark it was Angel that Law. shitty Japanese bottle. <laughs> Dark Angel Law, she had 100 bits saying Hosonaga really is Gumshoe's ancestor. Yeah. <laughs> what was that about? She seemed to avert her eyes when she answered the judge's question. I mean, she's been averting her eyes the whole time. Yeah, let's be clear. Oh, my friend. <laughs> Very well. I've seen her eyes yet. Counsel, you may resume the cross-examination. And the inspector will kindly control his fervor. <laughs> Die here, cut me some slack. Uh, uh, Alright, examine check. that bottle. Yep. <clears throat> bottle. Show me the bottle! Uh, oh, there we go. The label is written in a foreign language that I don't recognize. Do you know what it says, Kazuma? I think it's French. This must be very expensive water. Ah, yeah. Yes, but what does it say? That's what I was asking. Super poisonous water. Then go to France and ask. <laughs> you could just say that you don't know. <laughs> Doug, I request permission to go to France. Oh, what's that? So this carbonated water is the last drink Dr. Wilson ever had. It looks like there's a little left in the bottle. Although it's just plain water now. Well, it's just plain poison now. You know, I've been sweating so much, I'm absolutely parched. Uh, I'll just have a sip of this to keep me going. No! No, Ryanosuke, you can't do that. Don't drink the evidence. For one thing, that's evidence. You can't go drinking evidence. That's oh no, you're right. Oh no. We don't know oh, what no. might be inside, do we? You never cease to amaze me, Ryanosuke, in more ways than one. I wonder, could there be anything in this water? <laughs> What's the matter? You've gone all quiet all of a sudden. I think I might have just worked something out. An interesting possibility. Will that, will that update the evidence? Like, could we please just let us say that it could be poisoned? I don't think there's maybe anything now else you this. press, maybe now you press, uh, the statement where she said, if there's another way of killing somebody, show me. Yeah. Yeah. Try to push me to way. Okay. Present or press and then present? I feel like press because yeah, we don't. Yeah, press in case it changes her dialogue this time. Yeah. Or it gives you a prompt. And if it doesn't, then just present it. Yeah. Yeah. Present. No other way to present. Yeah. No other way to kill per someone. Um, present carbonated present. water. Oops. Don't look at it. Yes! Yep, okay, that's it. All right, Stop. there we go. What is this? The bottle of water? Actually, there is one method of killing a man without leaving a trace that comes to mind. Smacking him on the head with a bottle. <laughs> Obviously. <him> <laughs> I'm referring to poison. 
Poison. On the day of his death, we know that Dr. Wilson drank from this bottle of carbonated water. Could it be that there was poison inside? Uh. Could, could it be that the professor actually died after taking a sip from his glass? Then someone's gonna bring up, but she would have died too because she drank, and then we're gonna have to point out that there's a glass. Yeah. And there's empty glasses and shit. Uh -huh. Order! 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 And on that day. I don't know, I just went into Phoenix there. Uh, and on that day, really? who was sitting at the same table as the professor and able to slip the poison into his drink? There's only one person who could have possibly done it. Giselle Brett. It was you. It was you. This is outrageous to suggest such a thing without a scrap of evidence. You little rookie imbecile. Have you even considered how delicate, how, how, uh, have you even considered the delicate situation our country finds itself in now? Have you forgotten that we have only just signed an accord of friendship with the British Empire? Have you even the vaguest inkling that your rash accusations could jeopardize the entire treaty? Oh, Fauci, Objection. go die. Fuck off, I ain't going to jail. <laughs> this is not a political arena. This is a trial to determine one individual's guilt with respect to one crime. What? The fact that this woman is British makes no difference. We are here to determine the truth. <laughs> um... If I may... I will silence you forever for this disgraceful... <gasps> oh. oh! Now shut up! It is you who should be silent. <gasps> of, of course! <laughs> Dear lady! Where did that come from? She... she just snapped! God damn it, show us the eyes! I'm afraid I may have spoken unfairly before. I offer my most humble apologies. I'm sorry, my lady. To what are you referring? I described your police force as inferior. What I should have said was shit. <laughs> but no matter how inferior they may be, you still investigated this particular, particular point thoroughly, I believe. The bottle, I mean, Inspector, and whether it contained poison or not. Fuck, no we didn't. Of course. You, you did? Have you forgotten what my guiding principle is already? Oh, Sonago, we get it, but you could have said, hey, there was poison in the bottle they were drinking, by the way. I strive for a flawless investigation every time. Uh, I don't believe it. Naturally, we tested the inside of the bottle and its contents. And what did you find, Inspector? I ordered a poison toxin that's available in this country at the present time. We could oh. find no trace of poison of any description in the bottle of carbonated water, Your Excellency. Mm. Okay, but you said you what? tested for every toxin you know of in this in country. Yeah. Well, also in the bottle. It's true. She could have put it in the glass. What? Are you sure? The tests were meticulously carried out by the chief coroner himself. No. No! I'm shouting at him. I think it's some shit where we're going to have to point out that the glass was empty afterwards. Yeah. Because she emptied it. There's going to be traces there... on the glass that she still kept. Is yeah, what yeah. yeah. That's what, yeah. There's going to be yeah. traces on the glass that she took. I'm very grateful to all you Japanese. You've successfully established my complete innocence in this horrid affair. Thank you. But, but of course, dear lady, the pleasure was all ours. Oh, I was so sure. Can't be right. Everything falls into place if he was poisoned. Thank you, Council. I think that cross-examination has clarified everything. 
As the prosecution has have as, as the prosecution have asserted, a shot to the chest from this gun is the only conceivable cause of death. Furthermore, the accused, who by his own admission was holding this weapon, is the only possible culprit. I'm done for. The court wishes to apologize for the great inconvenience this has caused you, Miss Brett. Oh, no. I'm just glad the matter is resolved. Before proceeding, I must ask the counsel for the defense. Do you have any further new evidence to present to the court at this point? Oh, Kazuma? I'm sorry, Rinosuke. I have nothing more. Well, if you'll excuse me now, I really must be leaving. Hey. Hey. There we go. Hey. Let's go. Dun dun dun. It's a go. <laughs> Who's ready Please. for a cat fight? Yeah. <laughs> Please wait. Uh, isn't that? I think this is my favorite track of the of the game so far. Mm. What is the meaning of this? Forgive me for intruding on court proceedings, Your Excellency. Susato Mikotoba, judicial assistant to the defense. Oh. Mikotoba? In my darkest hour, with nowhere left to go, she appeared like a bolt of lightning. And no, she's hot. in her hand, she carried a small package wrapped in furoshiki cloth. Oh my god, are hey, you kidding me? We're already at to be continued? Are you Holy kidding me? shit! This is a long first case. Holy shit. <sighs> no but people weren't lying. Damn. <laughs> uh Yeah, I don't know, y'all. I think we should actually call it here. Yeah, That's over two hours of gameplay. Reasonable. I'm uh, fine with that. Damn. Yeah, people are saying we're only two thirds done. Jeez oh Pete's. That's insane. One final third. Wow. I really fucking thought we were going to knock that out I of mean, the park today. I mean, but... all other Ace Attorney cases are pretty damn short. They're usually like yeah. anywhere from an hour to two. Yeah. yeah. Sir GG says there's at least one hour more. Yeah. Dang. Then we're probably going to call it. Uh, we'll still obviously do art, but uh, I guess we'll finish this game next week. Uh, we got <laughs> prosecutorial cravat thief happy. Uh, me, Phoenix Pearl, and not Scrappy Doo. <laughs> Again, <laughs> I really like the the star eyes. The star eyes are really good. Damn, that cute. Uh, Neo, with in the future, can I? Can you please give Charlotte a French accent? It's a new thing for her. Oh, there we go. All right. <laughs> There's. I do love it. Again, Neo, like the hair. Uh, Miss Teak with Ellie Gant. Oh. Ooh, there's a like, new Gant in town. Like elegant? Elegant. Yeah. That's, yeah, good. that's good. That's very that's good. good fun. And I also love I yeah, like that. the working in of, of so many other Gant features. Uh, and Eloquent, which is also a great ah, pun name. That's very good. I love the it. puns are strong in this one. For sure. Uh, the Larry Butts Winston Payne fusion. <laughs> uh, obligatory Charziska art. <laughs> what is she doing to her hair? I don't know, but I love the. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and she smacks her. It's fucking good. <laughs> fucking good. Uh, the new cocktail master with uh, what? In, what's in Jake Marshall's flask? Day fourteen. For the Imperial Sergeant Yesenosa, with uh, grenadine for red, as Imperial Japan is often represented with the color red, and the other the other stuff is something you don't need to know. Well, now I'm terrified. Yeah. <laughs> don't drink that, kids. <laughs> it's poison. Uh, this is not curse. This is Dawnson, I think. Uh, collection of drawings surrounding my infamous curse. First are comics. Uh, the last is me as a detective. I kind of went. 
I went with a kind of Gak style, but let's be honest, I wear this anytime. Uh, yes, Don Sun, who, of course, has the uh, infamous curse of always simping for villains. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, I guess I'll do, do Donson. Your Honor, the defense accuses the witness of a crime. What? I've been here for six seconds. You have no evidence. <laughs> Miss Don, you must present evidence to the court to accuse the... Trust us, he's guilty. <laughs> <laughs> That's very funny. <laughs> the prosecution calls Hosodaka to the stand. Guilty! Your Honor, I simp! Well then, arrest this man at once. <laughs> I did nothing wrong, though. <laughs> uh, UT with uh, Herlock angst. Aw. We still haven't met Herlock. I want to meet Herlock so bad. I know, We're still I in know. Japan. We're still in Japan. We're still in the tutorial. I want to get some in Japan. Fish. I want to get some fish and chips. Yeah. And some, I want to I want to see all their baps. <laughs> uh Don uh yeah, July 30th was National Elevator Day, which is wild. Uh so yeah, here's what? another DL6 drawing. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's so good. It's so freaking good. good. <laughs> uh and more Herlock. The Reshlock's name, L Lohm's name, cheese to meet you. Uh, more Sherlock time. <laughs> Sherlock Holmes having a strong call a Rom Romdelaine? Romdelon? No, I don't know. Y'all, these words. We're not we're not smart boys. Blue blue words are hard. All of a sudden I had a stroke and died. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, apparently it's Romdulance. I don't know. Uh, JS on Mars got such a kick yeah. out of seeing Payne's ancestor. I drew a few more period ancestors for a few characters. I fucking love uh, these. Uh, fucking these Gumshoe, really awesome. Samurai. Also, oh, the, the fan being the ear instead of the, the pencil is a good touch. Uh -huh, yeah, I, uh -huh. that. I didn't notice that at first. Uh, Gantz. Gantz having the top knot. That's yeah. a lightning bolt. Mm -hmm. <laughs> The fucking still having the 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 symbols of the police Jake. department. Jake oh my Marshall god! Being a colonial American. That's incredible. <laughs> what a good day. That's god fucking hilarious. It. Fucking Paul, he's obsessed with Paul Revere and colonial yeah. America. <laughs> they shoot you for that in Boston. <laughs> they shoot you. Oh god. <laughs> And then just this awful, terrible and then this, body. The wor and then the worst, <laughs> the worst character in video games. That's so good. Thank you, JS. Uh, you see, here's some more wholesome Sholmes and Hosanaga to make up for the angst earlier. Oh, dang. Uh -huh. Shit, are uh -huh. we going to have to start shipping these two once uh, Sherlock shows up in the game? <laughs> Everyone just likes the hot, the hot boys. Mm -hmm. I mean, who doesn't like the hot boys? Uh, Don with the cryptid of Anytown, Ohio. Rare specimen that seems to feed off the unfortunate souls that perish in the no man's land of any town. Its head is always on fire and it likes to commit arson because, you know, why not? Its tail mimics weed and is used to lure the civilians of any town who seem to have a natural <laughs> instinct to pick weed. Its back is covered in spike to protect it from wild cobras and, of course, the cleaver arms used to steal people's kneecaps. This is, this is another joke that spawned from the community stream when we had Cleavy the Cleaver. Yes, Cleavy the Cleaver, the official mascot Cleavy the of Cleveland. Aww. We we needed that. We needed a. What was the prompt? Was it like a, a, a? What was the prompt for that? I legit have no idea how we got to Cleveland. It, it was it was something. I think was it just who's the official? Yeah, it was, it was just who's the official mascot of Cleveland. Yeah. And someone just wrote Cleavy the Cleaver. Yeah. Uh, mediocre potato with back at it again with another cupcake. This is an April May inspired uh. cotton candy camp cupcake with cotton candy buttercream uh. icing and filled with a sour lemon curd. I love oh, that. Oh my I, god. I love the idea of it being sweet on the outside but having yeah. a sour core. That's really very, brilliant. Very, very smart. It's really brilliant. Yeah, that's that looks so good. Like thematically, in taste and in appearance, it is spot on. Very, very good. Mediocre potato. Okay. You're more than just mediocre. Uh that's who's cool. your forgive me, I didn't make any GAC art because no no inspiration. Uh I planned an animatic, but it probably won't be finished because all the programs I've tried are absolute shit. Uh, only from animation that I finish is below. He's getting ready to destroy some doctors. Please forgive me. 
<laughs> oh, <laughs> that's cute with all the apples. <laughs> Uh, Neo, with a little height difference, go burr. Can you tell I'm short? <laughs> <laughs> Dang. Charlotte being six foot is something I can get into. That's powerful. Uh, also, some JoJo-ified OCs. I nice. fucking I love the Dolores one. The Dolores with the hair, the cacuine yeah. hair is really and the, good. And the, the very pronounced cheekbone. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. really powerful. Don, with more delight art because they... Gamer chat requested I draw them in onesies. Dolores would probably be fine with it, but Light would be embarrassed. I do, I do love his face. See, uh, <laughs> Light Light looks very shaggy-ish in that picture, he does which I look do enjoy. Which I do enjoy because it's like like Charlotte. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, Sean, I didn't finish it all the way, but the front and back of what will be a hand embroidered prosecutor's patch. That's dope as oh, shit. Oh, hell yeah. I was looking, That's I was really looking cool. at this earlier. That's amazing. It's really good. It's really good. Thank you. Oh, Sean. All right. oh no. <laughs> oh, no. Me after doing this and refusing to use a thimble. No, your poor fingers. Oh. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. Looks great, but I'm very sorry about your numerous fingers. Please recover quickly. <laughs> <laughs> Buy a thimble. <laughs> Uh, Don, with a pencil drawing of the Ace Attorney 7 Case 4 monster, and it mysteriously tracks. Names are appreciated. Uh, it would be it would lurk near Karain Village. Oh, it's really good. I don't. I think this is a, is maybe unintentional, but I like that the paws actually look like Magatama if it's near uh -huh. Karain. Uh, UT with Hosanaga. Man. Aww, what a cutie. You know. I know it's just the intro case. I'm I'm kind of like blase on Hosanaga, considering how much people are really liking him. I feel like I got to give yeah, more give he... more time in Hosanaga. That's the thing. I can't imagine that he's in it more. We'll find out. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I would be very shocked if he's in it more, and if he's not, y'all horny. Calm down. <laughs> wow, Wes calling the pot calling the kettle black. Uh, confused koala. Avatar chaos counts, right? Well, this place isn't half bad. I'm sure nothing weird happens at all. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> Nez eating a happy meal. Uh, <laughs> Rose being pursued by Needle. But also <laughs> Katana boyfriend, because I love him. <laughs> Aww. Also, I'm obsessed now. We've got another avatar to add to the, the club. Exactly. <laughs> Confused koala. Aww. Who's your uh, Bukes earlier practicing painting in a new style inspired by an outfit I found on Pinterest that reminded me of Edgeworth. It started as vampire Edgeworth, but turned into turnabout moonlight fan art. Heck yeah. Uh, right. I love the little little crow. Little crow with a key. I'm into it. Also, is it the key, is it the key of the channeling chamber? It's <laughs> the where? The what? The uh, just a random idiot joined the stream today. Yay! Welcome. Uh, anyways, art for Naramitsu, Hades Town AU. I've been working on with Edgeworth as Eurydice and Phoenix as Orpheus because it's currently uh -huh. my favorite musical, and I really just think oh. Naramitsu just fits. Uh, it's nice. really good. It's really good. Man, I almost I said Yuri Dice. <laughs> oh no! Thank God I didn't say that. Yuri so Dice. Uh, nope. Ever. Uh. Oh, okay, this is Phoenix and, and Edgeworth. That's a powerful stance. Indeed. So, do you think you... Uh, I'll go grab my steel samurai katana. <laughs> there you go. I love that. I love that. Uh, Nia, with the weird bang gang, Zach, no, don't you dare change up the wording. Oh. <laughs> Took me a second. Oh, on that one. Uh, That's yeah. That's good. I guess. That's good. <laughs> That's fucking great. Heck yeah. Uh, Blankus, it's their relationship in a nutshell, right? Haha, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> what if we kissed and held hands? Could you talk more clearly, partner? I'm afraid I don't speak bottom. <laughs> oh, it's so good. It's so good. Oh shit, also, I just saw somebody type out Eurydice spelled as Eurydice. And now I'm thinking Yuri on dice. 
that's, that's my anime joke for everybody. You're welcome. Uh, Hosanaga sketch tonight. Uh, Angle. And yes, uh, <laughs> I love the, the the little towel has what looks to be a little chicken on it, and I love that. <laughs> that's really cute. <laughs> Uh, edgy with why is Susato's hair pretty hard to draw <laughs> I almost <laughs> just read it as pretty and I was like wait See no that? there's more to the sentence uh, Gurgi or Gurgi I hope it's Gurgi I like Gurgi more hi this is my first time posting something welcome it's supposed to be Miles and Phoenix cosplaying Whoa. as Beric Van Zeeks and Rinosuke and Naruhodo from Great Ace Attorney Chronicles I painted it by hand so it's a bit rough no it's you fucking rad by hand? it's so good <laughs> That's insane. It's so oh good. Oh my god, that's that's incredible. Yeah. Gurgi. The the lighting on the like, the gold too is so good. Yeah. God, I just want to get to Van Von Zeke's already in this fucking game. I know. Just so I can hear I Wes do the voice and be like, that's pretty I have, good. I have voices for both Herlock and Baron Von Zeke's already. I'm so excited. Uh, Red Balloon, my second and final Ace Attorney OC, Lola Baker. She's a part-time detective and part-time baker. <laughs> I love that. Also, <laughs> you're under my lap. I love it. Uh, oh, shit. It's uh, Giselle. Ooh. Ooh, really that's like that. a spooky one, Angle. Yeah. God, I just want to see her face. I know, I know, right? Show me your face. It's gonna be so worth it. It's gonna be so worth it, though. I know. Oh my god. I know. It's gonna be so hot when we get to see her eyes. Shut up, uh, <laughs> Queen Trash Panda. Wrong, Here's Prosecutor Wes. Is the hair gay enough, though? Uh, <laughs> Judge Pridge and Officer Zach, whom I wanted to make a dapper lawyer, but he somehow kept going all grizzled detective instead. <laughs> uh, I I oh, love shit. that. I just realized that any I love that. background. I love that Pridge looks like <laughs> Pridge. It looks like you're using the gavel as like a pipe, which it's, is really so, fucking so. This cool. is this whole thing is inspired by the Castlevania Circle of the Moon box art. Oh yeah, which is Queen Trash Panda. Yes, my hair is sufficiently gay. <laughs> I appreciate it. Rocking that homosexual hair. Uh, Don, the idea popped in my head after Hosanaga said that he was an undercover detective decided to give him a bit more fitting outfit for his role. Yes, he has a cravat. <laughs> Hashtag <laughs> Rosanaga. Rosanaga. <laughs> God damn it. Donson just adding cravats so, so she can send part her. Uh, oh, this is so good. Curse. Oh, that's horrible. That's with the With the Phoenix Layton crossover art. It's yeah. fucking great. Very cute. Also, uh, oh, that's so the 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 group the, the the group of artists that have been doing a lot of stuff now call themselves the gamer chat, which is also really good. <laughs> <laughs> also, I love the use of color. In I was going to say, I just realized also the the fading is actually the pride flag. Yeah, the red. That's yeah. Yeah. It reflects as rainbow. a rainbow. That's really good. Very well done. The subtle, uh, the subtle color gradients are accidentally used. Yeah. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Queen Trash Panda Gant can't be stopped. I love this. Just Gant and Von Karma in prison together. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking great. I really do want to see this, like uh -huh. a fucking sitcom of this. Jingle, pick it to you with uh, an art trade with Neo. Yeah, uh, their version of Charlotte Gant, which fucking kicks yes. ass. Yes, that slap. She's hot in that one. Yes, I mean, it's not fucking killing the game. And uh, Neo did their version of Ivana Dance, which also nice. kicks ass nice as well. Yeah, oh. it's so good. Y'all kill it. Y'all killing it. Uh, don't mind my profile pic. I don't want to zoom in on the profile pic. Uh, I'm in school also. I'm restricted to my iPad, so I couldn't draw that much. Also, I'm going to be late to the stream. Sad. Anyway, take this page of Doodle Doodles Later Mates. Also, no pun name this week. Oh, this is Rose. <laughs> Took me a second. Uh, let me get the zoom. <laughs> Fucking uh, Kazuma, which is Rose in the background, fangirling. Uh, <laughs> in the fan translation baby boy baby and then the <laughs> actual thing Ryan evil <laughs> <laughs> just more simping more simping for Van Zeeks uh, uh, uh. fuck god no don't let me forget his name one more time uh, uh, Abraham Von Renoir. Renoir. Yes, thank you, Von Renoir. 
I am the magic man. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Duck Edgeworth, Platypus Edgeworth, Rose Approved, <laughs> Doing uh, Ya! <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. Rose, always fantastic. Absolutely. I'm Killing obsessed it. with the art style. That's pretty so usual. Cute. The biggest tree. Hey, it's me, Tall Thing. Discord is being a little bitch and won't let me change my username, but it's fine, so I have this. How their first kiss went, like. <laughs> okay, Edgeworth, your rival and you, your rival and you just you're his rival and you just kissed. Now that's a big that, that's a bit big, but it's most likely, but it most likely doesn't mean anything. Even though you have unnecessary feelings for him, and he probably doesn't feel the same. Let's fucking go! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's Let's so good. Fucking go! God damn it! Uh. Also, more these two, two grandparents from my OC. I can't remember their names who met around when the Ace Journey Chronicles happened. <laughs> it's so cute. Aww. I must say, I'm honored that you took the time to help me. It means nothing, you worm. Are you sure about that, sweetheart? Yeah. Stop calling me that. <laughs> I'm serious though, I'm thankful. Oh please, if you're ever if you've ever been thankful. If I wasn't, when I be talking to your goofy face. My face is not goofy. <sighs> That's beside the point, sweetheart. But I'm telling you this. Oh no. What happened? Did it suddenly get sad? <laughs> uh I don't know what happened. Did we get bamboozled into a sad? No, I think we just got we just got tricked into a sad. We did. Stop smoking at your grandpa's grave, you little bitch. Bonk. <laughs> Damn. Uh, cursed. I'm really proud of this piece because I drew a background this time, and the anatomy is good, and it's King's Quest. Hope y'all like King's, King's Quest. Quest. I yeah, love King's Graham. Quest. Also, the the Ace Attorney name of Graham Cracker is so good. Ah, oh, damn. It's so good. And yeah, that's a that's a really wonderful gram. Uh, Curse. That's yeah. You nailed it again. And the, and the shading on this one is fantastic everywhere. Yeah. Top of the oh, game. Damn it. Oh Make shit. Play more King's Quest. Queen Trash Panda. Can I get some bridge points? <laughs> <laughs> With Judge Bridge leaning damn. over the table is so good. Powerful. <laughs> Thank you. I mean, position to approach permission to approach the bench. Uh, Curse with here's a photograph of some concepts of a new Sona Ace Attorney design. They're wearing a digital mask that changes due to to different faces due to a horrible marring of their real face. They're constantly changing everything about their outer appearance. Most people can figure it out because of their calling card, which I haven't decided yet. They killed a lot of people, like Rose in the DLC incident, but only in alternate <laughs> universes, so the deaths don't count. Uh, I actually really love that as a concept for a character in these yeah. two mm -hmm. games. Is it, yeah. is it the uh, this, is it the scanner darkly mask? Yeah, it kind of it, it totally it gives me through a scanner face. darkly. Yeah, that's good. Uh, Neo with their first drawing of Manfred. Is that true? What? My emperor, I have failed yeah. you. <laughs> My emperor, <laughs> I failed you. Star Fox reporting in. Queen Trash Panda. Guess who's on the train to Horny Jail? Oh shit. It's the oh, judge yeah. with the Scottish accent. Yes, look at him. That's so good. So this garb is common in Britain? <laughs> uh, my OC Tim Parole, the out-of-time attorney. More designs for him uh, and his mystical festival, Abby Fay. As mentioned before, she's a Fay from the Salem Witch Trials. I fucking love that concept. Uh, Tim saved her by, by taking her with, this, with her... Tim saved her by taking him with her this time in his time traveling trailer, and they've been partners ever since. Uh, fucking love it again. Like the witch outfit for like a fae, mm. fucking radical. Uh, also like the magatama fitting like in between the collars, so cool. Love that. It's great. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Wonderful concept. The bre the breakdown sprites. I fucking love it. <laughs> Thank you, Credo Wizard. 
Uh, Yuti with Kazuma is a Chad, a Chadzuma, if you will. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking good. That's was nonchalant good. riding the That's... skateboard. Mm-hmm. I was gonna say when he's actually moving, do the ribbons not move? Are they still? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> Dilf Lakachu Sholmes with Maid Zuma. Sorry. <laughs> I fucking love it. And I love it that everyone keeps drawing Kazuma in a fucking maid outfit. <laughs> you see the second one? Yeah. How may I help you, Nya? <laughs> <laughs> Very good. God damn it. Um, we got Edgeworth and Sands would be the besties. I will not change my. <laughs> oh my god. Is that my bestie in a Tessie? <laughs> the idea that <laughs> the idea that Sands would drive a Tesla is also pretty funny to me. Uh, the biggest tree. Fun fact: Before I watched the first episode of Eastern Chronicles, I didn't know Ryan was a nickname for Ryanosuke, and that's kind of embarrassing now because I love him with all my heart. <laughs> Who's Ryan? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> we just made him Ryan because of me talking about a gaming journalism website that made a review which we, they pronounced his name badly. We Very created badly. Ryan. Yeah. Uh, we decided that his name is Ryan whenever he's being dumb. I don't know, more Herlock. Well, surprisingly, he was not. He was pretty much never a Ryan today. No, we we barely called him Ryan. Yeah, yeah was, I think he, he Ryan he Ryan once. I think. Yeah, mm-hmm. I think he Ryan once. For the most part, he was he, he was, was on, on his game. He brought his A game. There. Brought his A game. Uh, a random dude of Charlotte on Bob, name generated from Quick Flash. Her horse. Uh, <laughs> Lemon Dragon, the spoiler cursed. This is my first time posting art in this channel. Welcome. But I also Welcome, wanted to share, thanks for posting. I wanted to share the liner of my second ace attorney OC, Rainy Weathers. God damn, they all are good with these names. Yeah. Gloomy and shy poet in contrast to her sister, Sunny. I'll post her again, too. Uh, Hope you yeah. enjoy them. Uh, uh, Rainy's giving me Violet from the Incredibles vibes. Yeah, but I also, I love, I, I just enjoy. love the fucking, the clouds and all of their clothes. It's so fucking and the, good. The the lines that go from the hair into the sweater, which mm-hmm. are really, really cool. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. It's great. It's great stuff. And I love that they're sisters. Ah, they're both great. <laughs> Done with Thank Emperor you so Von much, Charm. Lemon Dragon. <laughs> I failed you, my Emperor. <laughs> oh, no. Tom Tanks with Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. And it's that's fucking a, Blue oh, Badger sh- Meekins and Tommy Faye. Right <gasps> oh, shit. Uh, oh, more, <laughs> more Kazuma is a maid. Everybody's all about cause we gotta we gotta bust out the maid outfits again, clearly. I know, right? <laughs> uh Donson with the Timmy gun. <laughs> bat, 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 bat. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> uh Nia with a present a chalkboard of doodles. It's my friend's chalkboard. I began to use uh oldest drawing is mine, the donut. <laughs> the fucking suck. The Edgeworth the suck one is so good. Uh <laughs> fucking Rinosuke oh, and Sherlock great. at the grill. Butlet. <laughs> Weavy grilling. Hot stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Butlet. <laughs> uh, Sufa with Meekins Ooh. earlier this week. The rendering liquid so sucks. Ooh. Oh, my God. Ooh, shit. Oh, it's so that's, good. That's chilling. I'll do my best, sir. And I hope you do your best, too, sir. For your sake, the blood dimension isn't a very forgiving place, you know. That was really good. Oh, <laughs> that shit. was really good. Uh, <laughs> five minutes and it's <laughs> canon now. Fuck, that's so good. The bird yeah. holding the gun. <laughs> God damn. Oh, Sufa, thank you. <laughs> Uh, now the show that's officially French, she's almost a carbon copy of Lafayette, specifically from Hamilton. God damn it. <laughs> Very good. Uh, Big Street, work in progress. Oh. <laughs> yes. yes. We do the dipping yes. kiss. Yes. Partner. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Steph Ladder. Yep, I am 100% <laughs> going to throw that into the middle of the video. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <Fuck>. More Charziska. <laughs> Aww. Aww. <laughs> All of the homo. <laughs> no homo. <laughs> God damn it. 
Uh, I'm not good at draw 10N. I'm not good at drawing, but I remade Emma's drawing in MS Paint <laughs> with pencil and paper. Hey, honestly, <laughs> looks better than Emma's drawing. Looks, yeah, better than I remember, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> oh, shit, biggest tree with the updated version. Hell yeah. It's great. Oh, it's Evidence Raw Volume 2. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just saw that. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, <laughs> Vinny Chewed 100 bits saying, I think the Meekins lore is my favorite part of this channel. Uh, it's definitely one of my favorite running jokes for sure. Oh, absolutely. Uh, Rose, I'm back from school. Edit flip. I missed 90% of the gameplay. Uh, <laughs> I forget. Uh, uh, did I you do, do Rose's voice? I do look. I think so. I yeah. do love the the Sailor Moon yes. school out and the and the chewing That's the really bagel oil running or the donut oil running. Uh -huh. My name is Rose Hanakami. I'm an ordinary Discord artist for the Save <laughs> Data team during their Ace Attorney with a real lawyer playthrough. But running a little late for my weekly stream. Ugh, curse my time zone. I have to hurry up quickly if I ever want to make any fan art for the stream. Even though Pridge says that I'm not obligated to do so, but I have to. But I have the need to do so. Also, in some twist of fate, I'm apparently. I'm apparently now an Ace Attorney character. Therefore, I got accused of murder. So not only am I late, but I'm also on the run. <laughs> uh, uh, we, ah, there it is. I can still make it before the stream ends. Hey, <laughs> Ned. Hey, Ned Sensei. It's past 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You know what that means. <laughs> no, Ned. All right. Ned isn't here today. Aww. Rose was then arrested on the charges of murder due to her now being an Ace Attorney character. It's so good. It's so fucking good. <laughs> Dude, that was a little fade of all <sighs> Rose, it's amazing as uh, always. Rose, love uh, it. Love you, Rose. <laughs> Yay, love. I love this one so See? much. See? <laughs> she could hide a dozen guns under here. <laughs> and I also love that the, not only is, is she mad, but the goose is mad. But you know, it's with no chill. I love it. Uh, <laughs> It's really good. It's fucking good. It's so fucking good. <laughs> uh, I used to work at NASA, and Meekin's Warp Theory literally sounds like something I would hear at the office, so I had to paint him during the first room I could catch. Spoilers because blood, lol. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. The, the Blue Badger crown outline is also really good on this, though. Diflockachu Sholmes, I will not stop with the Maid Zuma propaganda. <laughs> Hello, Nya. How may I help you, Nya? <laughs> uh, Lee with the sketch of Lana Sky. It's really cute. That Lana's so cute. Yeah. I love her little upturned nose. Uh, and Blue. Uh, oh, right. Sherlock voice. I mean, oh, you're going to do Sherlock, Sherlock voice. Yeah. Ah, Mr. Norahodo. Perfect timing. Could you go over to that counter and grab me a toasty? Toasty. Love uh, it. What? <laughs> uh, Rose, uh, get it? Because the ship sounds oh, like Charizard. Am I oh, funny? That's so oh, adorable. Nah. Yeah, that's good. That's oh good. Oh, that's so adorable. Franziska in a Charizard hoodie is the cutest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> She's so embarrassed. <laughs> Uh, Neo with literally anyone jingles drawing. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh, step ladder, triplets separated at birth. Oh, shit. <laughs> the, third one, the third one got me. The third one got That's, me. That, that makes it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, Jingle Piketty, you know what? Fuck it. I was going to do the cat meme with me, Rose, and Ryan, but honestly, he doesn't deserve it. Doesn't deserve my blessed touch yet. I hope... His pillow is very warm. <laughs> <laughs> it's really good, though. Damn. The expression is so perfect. <laughs> uh, AU where Phoenix and Rionoski are cousins. I will advocate for this until the end of my days. Uh, hey, Suzato. I told you that the turnabout tarot was my cousin. Holy shit, Phoenix, right? <laughs> I like that. Uh, <laughs> you in love with the uh, ouchie and the old horny jail? <laughs> no simping for racists. That's really good. Very good. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Sorry, I got to 
Tom Tanks. That's incredible. <laughs> uh, oh, shit. Wait, what? What the fuck? <laughs> Dr. Oxid, I did not expect this. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, the gun uh, animation is perfect. Oh, my oh, God. Oh, shit. Shit, that's really good. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, Giant Five Head, the great nice attorney character design. I love it. I love him so much. Best in the whole series, dare I say, with Cosma and Herlock being my favorite. But they're so hard damn. to draw. But they make that's it look an easy. Awesome sketch. Yeah, of was, that's Holy excellent. They make it look really easy. A little. Is this Giant Five? No, Giant Five Head's posted before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Jeez. Please, please, please sue me if I've posted this already. I don't think so. I don't think so. No, I don't think so. Okay, just hold on to my hand. I don't want you. Get, I don't want you to get lost. <laughs> info dump. Info dump. <laughs> just fucking Pearl, or yeah, Pearl just zooming by, <laughs> angry at the boys <laughs> holding hands. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> fucking Apollo. Oh my God! When we get to Apollo justice. The I'm finding is going to be so annoying. <laughs> uh, Gia with I'm so dumb at posting this art but here are so many art hey. channels oh, no, I'm sorry Effie Dents problematic older sister Eva Eva Dents <laughs> or Evangeline <laughs> so he, yeah Eva Dents yes. God damn. she looks great that's really cool again the names the name puns are, are absolute top notch oh yeah they're like on point tonight uh, Lucid Gamer based on something I think I heard during the segment it's He's just super thorough, Lamal. First time posting it, I think. Pog. Well, look, welcome, Lucy Gamer. I strive for in I strive for investigative perfection, and so I stole the crime scene as evidence. <laughs> How did you do this? Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. I was able to steal. Just, just the, the entire, entire rash drop. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's really Somehow good. transported the rash drop. That's so good. And some old art. Don't judge me. Okay, uh, your your herlock is good. It, it's a it's it, a super drama. It's John, it, Total drama. No, no, oh. no that's, John, that's John Kennedy from Clone High. That's oh, what it is. Yep, 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 yep. John, I, I believe. I think it's John F. Kennedy. I know. I, I know like, it's Clone High. I think it's John Kennedy from Clone High. I was yeah. like, it looks incredibly familiar. Yeah, no, and he, that's he, why. And it, it actually it actually lines up really well. It's super. Oh cute. yeah. <laughs> Nothing in life matters. God damn it. Uh -huh. Shums and Hosanaga kiss. Again, I guess we're going to have to ship these two now. Yeah, that's. Uh, and Dr. Austin with Phoenix Wright's final day off. <laughs> Again, I do love me some. Uh, what are these called? SFMs? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes, yes. Absolutely. Yes. Fantastic. I do. I love them as well. And folks, great, for two, great for two things. Weird TF2 based videos yeah. and porn. Yeah. This is true, Doctor Oxid. I'm gonna have to check out uh, check out these videos because they look very good and very funny. And uh, folks, I just locked it, so I'm sorry, but you can't post anymore. Get locked. That is gonna do it for another week's episode of Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney with an actual lawyer. Again, thank you so much for watching. If you're catching the show on YouTube, you can also catch it live on Twitch.tv slash Save Data Team every Wednesday night at 7:30 p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, if not, no worries. It goes up edited the very following Monday and Tuesday on our YouTube channel. But until next time, court is adjourned. <laughs>